I know you have been here for 2000 World Championship. So, what's the difference for the case? Yeah, um, yeah, I was here two, year ago, two years ago for the uh, Worlds, and uh, I had a different car then, I had the Mugen. But uh, the track is, I think, a lot different than 2010. Um, I think a lot of people think that the track's easier than uh, now. It's easier now than it was two years ago. But um, as you can see, I think they've put down their oil, or I don't know what it is, but I think it's a lot smoother, and um, yeah, it's, it's still, everything's still the same, but the track's kind of, you know, Quite easier to drive and not as not as rough on the cars. So this year, I think it's probably a bit better. Yeah, sugar water. Yeah. How how do you change your car? I mean, the setup, suspension, oil, stuff. Yeah. Basically, we don't really change a lot. The main thing we do change is shock oils mm -hmm. and um, shock position as well on my on my tower. So I don't know. We were here practicing a couple of days ago, and it was nothing like this because they hadn't put the sugar water on yet. So we've, you know, made the trying to make the car not tippy, you know, because there's so much grip, so much more grip than it was before. So we go harder shock oils and lay my shocks down, so, you know, a bit more stability for my car, and it's better. I found something chain, like a left jump, the two jump, the double. Yeah, double jump. Yeah. The and the first, I think it's just single finger. Yeah. You change your just two. Well, the, the track's definitely got much much more grip now. So I know I've seen a couple of people try it, and it's a lot quicker. So I thought I'd try. Yeah, yeah. Well, as long as you're confident with your car and you know you're going to make it, then so you it's get the full power? yeah. If you need lots of bottom end power, yeah. but my car is really good, and I feel like I can do it every lap. So. You know, if I'm confident that I'm going to make it, I'll do it, and it's a lot faster for me. So, it's working good so far. So you know, right now you are very famous. So, do you have any suggestion for the for the driver from the other country in Asia? Yeah. Yeah, because like me, I think you are the top driver. Uh, even have to be the international driver. Yeah. And can compete to Europe or America. So. Oh, we just want to you give some suggestion for this driver that respect to you, you know? Yeah. Okay. So we do you have any suggestion for the driver from the other country? You should know. Yeah, well, you know, I, I, when I'm at home, I, you know, try to get out of the track as much as I can. I know it's hard in Australia because we have a lot of rain as well as here. So, I don't know, I think if you really want to, you know, be serious about racing and try to go as good as you can, just practice as much as you can because the more you run the more you better you get so if you don't run enough you know and you come out you can't expect to you know be really fast or as good because uh, practicing definitely makes perfect so if you want to you know try to get out to the track as much as you can and just learn from other people and learn about your car try you know try all different things on your car to know what it does so you know you know whatever track you come to you know what your car is comfortable with and all that sort of stuff so um, yeah, just practice as uh, much as you can. As you can see, I run the Kyosho for Team Kyosho. I run Proline tires and OS engines. Um, also sponsored by KO, I run their servos and their radio. Um, pretty much nothing's different to what you can buy for the TKI 3 kit. Um, it's all the same. Uh, I don't really change a whole lot. If you find a base setup, which is pretty much, you know, standard you don't really get to change a lot depending on what track you go to you might change suspension or you know diffs cambers all that sort of stuff your geometry but apart from that i don't really change a lot um for this track i've basically just gone harder oils and laid my shocks down that's pretty much the only thing i've done so um yeah everything's been working good for me um my tires are really good pro line tires been running the blockade uh m3 and m2 pretty much the whole week so I haven't had any dramas with that, so, and KO Propo servos, they'll last you forever, and they're really reliable, so, everything's been working good, and uh, definitely if you want to be competitive and, you know, have a reliable car and a car that won't, you know, wear out fast, then definitely Kyosho is a, definitely the, a good car to choose. Inside, yeah? Yeah. It's from there. Yeah. Start. Yeah. What you see? Uh, 
OS speed. We've been running the 2060 pipe this weekend because the track's so big. We just found it better. Um, mainly on the big straights and long sweepers. Gives us a bit more power. The only thing I've changed here is I've milled out holes in here just to get a bit of air into the receiver pack and the receiver. Because it gets really hot. It's so hot because it's uh, really humid over here. So yeah, we found that, you know, drilling holes lets the air come into the receiver. And uh, pretty much everything's the same. We run the new BSX server for steering. It's pretty fast. I really like it a lot. And uh, yeah, apart from that, everything's pretty much standard you could buy. Um, if you get an OS engine, it's all the same. Nothing's modified, nothing's special. So everything is uh, really good and working out for me so far. So how about down start? Is, is lower or higher? Hey. Down start. My ride height? Yeah. Lower or higher? Yeah, I think I've, I've gone a bit lower this weekend for my uh, ride height because uh, the track's really fast, so it kind of helps it not to tip as much, which is, you know, what we're kind of looking for. So apart from that, everything's pretty much the same. I've gone more cambers because yep. the, the track's a lot different, you know, to what I run at home. It's really big and open. So apart from that, everything's pretty much the same. Zero degrees toe and, uh, yeah, three degrees toe at the back, which is pretty much, we never change that. So, so about the time, you're softer or maybe softer? Yeah, we've found that in the afternoon we run the M3s which is soft so it's a bit cooler so I think it's better then but during the middle of the day it gets really hot so we run the M2s but I think definitely the tyre wear is pretty you know after 10 minutes the tyres are pretty worn so um, definitely for the finals I think we'll go the M2 tyre I think it will be the best idea so I think that's you know how about what the suspension? Because I found the suspension position right here. Yeah, I've laid it. Different with the other driver, you know? Yeah, uh, the other guys running Kyosho's, we've kind of told them, you know, to give this a go. I think they've all been trying to run that, and I think they've found it's the best. It kind of just makes the car mm -hmm. around the big long straights, it makes it, you know, stable and fast. Stable. Okay. So you don't want a traction roll or anything like that. So we've been, we tested that before with the race, so kind of found it was the, you know, the best thing. We don't really change much. Blue springs always on the rear. We've gone uh, harder on the front springs. Yep. We've gone to grades, which is um, a couple of springs harder, which is kind of helped the car settle down as well. That's basically all we've been trying to do this weekend is settle the car down to make it less edgy and nervous. And uh, the setup we got at the moment's, you know, we can pretty good. Very hard shockles. We went. Low see all we run, uh, 50 weight in the front. It looks like a uh, road car. <laughs> yeah, on road car, yeah, so much grip. Uh, 50 weight and 40 weight, okay. which is not really normal for what we run. Usually at home I'll run 45, 30, so, which is pretty much stand, we don't change that. But yeah, this weekend we've gone 50 and 40 and found it's good. So. No wonder you have a good record. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> the car's really comfortable, so I'm just trying to find a good setup. You know that can last me. You know that I'm comfortable with for the one-hour main. So that's what we look for. So that's how.